Carolyn Herforth here with thebiztruth.com and today I'm going to talk about how to have a sales conversation that doesn't feel or sound salesy. So there are three shifts, three things for you to just shift a little bit in your conversation. The first one is you know your value, right? You have to know your value and know it and articulate it in a way that your clients care about. So that's the very first thing. So it's knowing your value inside of you, like, wow, I'm really worth this. And then also knowing the outside, the language around it, the benefits that your clients would care about. The second thing is that you need to know how to have a conversation that reveals whether or not your potential client actually values your value. And you do that through what I call benefits questions. And then the third thing is so many people when they get to the close feel really awkward. And what you need to do is you're not asking your potential client for a favor. So what I recommend is that you make a recommendation. It puts you in the expert seat. You're recommending what you believe would be the best course for them based on the conversation that you had. So if you're in the New York area, you're gonna wanna know about this. I'm holding a free half day sales training for up to 50 entrepreneurs, where you're gonna learn these three shifts. We're gonna dive way deeper into what those three shifts are and apply them to your business. Melissa, in her case, applied them and made a sale the very next day at a 50% higher rate than she had in the past because she felt so much more confident. It's that simple. If you can put it into effect like Melissa did the very next day, you're gonna, it's gonna make a huge difference for you. So you need to reserve a seat. You need to apply to reserve your seat. So just go to thebiztruth.com slash true slash sales and put in your application and we'll get you confirmed. I'll see you there. Mm -hmm.